Well, she was bruised, but not broken. And now an Austin area woman who's left behind more than a decade of domestic violence is making bow ties. And Juan Rodriguez spoke with Dianca Ruffin about her recovery. Cutting fabric was not always something Dianca Rufin did. This sewing machine, it allowed me to have a voice when I didn't have a voice. Her happiness is now seen through vibrant colors, sewing away the memories of a difficult past. Over time, progressively got worse. She was trapped in a 12-year relationship of abuse, humiliation, and violence. There was a situation where I had, you know, his hands around my neck. Sadly, she was another domestic violence statistic since the number of women caught up in cycles of abuse are growing. According to the nonprofit group No More, one in four women experienced violence from their partners in their lifetimes. When I left the situation, I had zero, nothing but the clothes on my back and a couple of outfits in my car. But she says her physical and emotional exhaustion was eventually taken away through the use of fabric, needle and thread. And since leaving her abusive partner, she started her own business called Bow Inertia. That I could use that to, to help me, that's how it all got started. She's now made more than a thousand bow ties of all shapes and sizes. My, my main thing in all of this is you can't change somebody. You can't change a person. Forgetting the past by creating. Like it literally saved my life because it, it allowed me to express myself. She's now using her new business as a way to shape her own destiny. That's just not how we should live. You know, that's not how, how, how love works. In Austin, Juan Rodriguez, KBU News.